is summer in Southern California. Summer means more great white sharks have arrived. It also means the waves are a little bit smaller than in the winter. The water has warmed and sharks are once again in very large numbers. Do you see the four sharks here? As I fly my drone over Southern California waters, I've found that great white sharks may be smarter than we once thought. Notice how these three sharks form a perfect shark fin shape. I have also found that these sharks are non-aggressive a vast majority of the time. Notice how this shark comes extremely close to a snorkeler, but never makes aggressive movements. This footage is a perfect example of how sharks are not aggressive. And even though this snorkeler has no idea that this shark is here and he splashes a lot when he makes his dive, which makes sharks interested, he still doesn't attack. In the summer, the water is also clear. You can see that here. Watch as this shark beautifully glides through this healthy reef. Another thing that happens a lot in the summer is that these sharks come into very shallow water close to shore. Notice how that wave rolls right over that shark and you cannot see the shark anymore. Usually, I am just flying the drone over the sharks like this, but other days, I find something I did not expect to see, like this shark gobbling up a fish as it turns to its side, or clips like this, where a shark completely comes out of the water and splashes down hard on its back after breaching. This is the largest shark I've filmed so far. I estimate it to be around 11 to 12 feet. The unfortunate thing about this clip is that this shark is actually swimming through a lot of plastic debris. You can see the white dots on the top of the frame. You can see the debris here too. Notice the white object on the top left in this clip. At first glance, I thought this was a dead ray. And it certainly looks like that. But as I move the drone closer, you will see that it is actually a kite that has flown into the ocean. This is very unfortunate, and we need to remember that we need to pick up after ourselves and not leave things in the ocean. But sometimes you capture incredible things like this, where a tagged great white shark glides through the waves and shows off its fin at sunset. This clip is long, but I'm going to let it play through. Another incredible thing that I've captured recently is this large shark diving into the deep water and making a big splash.
This is one of the wildest clips I've captured all year. Notice these two sharks swimming parallel, extremely close to a group of surfers, but the surfers have no idea that the sharks are there. Most people think great white sharks are completely solitary animals, but I have clips such as this clip where three sharks appear extremely close to one another. Great white sharks are a very endangered species, and there are only a few thousand left of them total in the world. And if great white sharks go extinct, it is not only bad news for the ocean, but it is bad news for the whole earth. The earth cannot survive without sharks. One out of every two breaths we take is from the ocean. One thing you can do to help prevent shark fishing is to not go to any place with shark products and to not buy any shark products from anybody. If there is not enough demand for shark products, fishermen will have no reason to catch sharks. So please do whatever you can to help protect sharks. Every shark is very important at this time. Sharks are truly incredible creatures, and protecting them is now vital with the number of sharks left in the world to help the earth and the oceans survive. If you like my shark footage, Please like and subscribe. It would show a lot of support to the channel, which I'd really appreciate. Thank you.